Okay, I'm heading to London Zone 1 for a meeting with five guys on an open source wind turbine. Not quite sure what to expect yet, but we want success. So, here we go. Okay, so here we are with Alvaro in London. We've just had a meeting, a conversation about wind turbines. Um, there's a project starting out, starting up to push for an open source wind turbine, the development of a wind turbine. Um, so Alvaro, if you could please introduce yourself and uh, talk about your direction in, in wind turbines. So um, I've been working for a couple of years in the wind industry and I've joined this group because I'm really interested in the open source ecology project and uh, I'm hoping that in the European team we can contribute towards designing or building this open source wind turbine. So we had a meeting today where uh, there were different groups with different approaches to this. Uh, there's a team in the UK or uh, an organization that's called Onawi and they are trying to uh, release some 150 kilowatt uh, designs, so 150 wind turbine uh, designs and try to bring them to the market, bring this design and have it manufactured. They have a lot of the structure of this turbine uh, has been shared uh, by Folk Center, a research center in Denmark. And there are a lot of components that they would need to probably outsource or get, such as gearbox, generators, and so on. Um, on the other hand, the scoping of a turbine for open source ecology was probably a smaller turbine, something around 30 kilowatts, maybe between 10 and 50 kilowatts, something that could be maybe manufactured with less uh, high-tech industrial means. Um, and basically, We've been trying to see where we can overlap, where we can use the synergies uh, to collaborate and using things that are already available and open, whether it's tools or software or uh, things like uh, the tools from NREL, for example, the National Renewables Energy Lab in the US, or things from uh, Fox Center in Denmark, and all these things, electronics, sensors, and so on, and how things that are already open source can be integrated to make uh, a turbine of these sorts. Um, so where are we so far? Well, uh, we've defined how at least the team that we were here, which was five people, how we wanted to get involved, uh, what we wanted to achieve in the next months, which is basically a little bit of documentation, uh, a little bit of contacting experts, see what sources of funding there is, and uh, that's about it. We still need to define maybe what would this turbine um, power? What would it power? Um, you know, how expensive would it be? What materials? How? What techniques of manufacturing would we allow ourselves to use? And so on. So I think that's the next step. Defining a little bit better what this turbine is and trying to see who can help us, who will join us, and uh, what's out there as funding. Yeah, okay. Take it from there. Great. Well, thank you very much. Yeah. Alvaro. Thank you.